today is a super exciting day because husband John is with us. That's a great intro, thank you. We didn't want to cook because we're really lazy. So we decided that we'd go out and buy a bunch of like vegetarian and vegan junk food. We're gonna test it out for you guys and let you know if you should buy it or not. So we got our plates ready and we split everything in half. We're just gonna start off with the burrito. This one is from Amy's Gluten-Free Burrito. This is 100% vegan. Cheers. Oh, <laughs> dang. Mm. That is so good. Damn. Okay, I've had these out of the microwave. Don't do that. Take the extra 20 minutes to put it in the oven. Dang. These are so good. Like this is the best frozen burrito I've ever had in my entire life. That's a good start. Amy's gluten-free. Wow, wait, this is gluten-free. Oh wow. I don't know what that means. This is amazing. Oh my gosh. You know when you get a frozen burrito and they say like beans and rice, but it's really just like mushed up nasty beans. This is like a real bean. That's huge. Wow. What do you rate this? 10. Nine. Ten. Nine. Nine? Well, there's gotta be, this can't be the greatest thing on this plate. This is the best thing. Okay, fine. I rate this a 10.5. Out of 10. <laughs> so, we bought two veggie patties to see which one's like better. So, we have the Morning Star Spike. Shoot, I can't read like that. Morning Star Farms Veggie Burger Spicy Black Bean. And it looks like this. Apparently, it's America's number one veggie burger. We'll see about that. So we got some Ezekiel bread to make it better. You have to make your own sandwich. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I can make it. I'm just such a good wife. So we have our situation here. We put some ketchup on it to like give it a little bit of flavor. Wait, how'd you do that? Okay, cheers. Very chewy. I don't know. What do you think? I'll tell you once I'm done eating. I feel like we've been chewing for so long. It's definitely like a chewing type of food. Like you can't just inhale it. Did you forget to chew your burrito? Yeah, I feel like I just swallowed it. It's good. The patty is good, it has a lot of flavor, and I think the ketchup definitely helps. You can make it better if you made it into like a real sandwich. Lettuce and tomato and like avocado and stuff. That'd be really good. I'm gonna rate this Morningstar Spicy Black Bean Burger Patty uh, an eight out of 10. Where are you? Let's go seven. So now we have another Morningstar Veggie Burger. This one's the Garden Veggie Burger. It looks like this. This one's just vegetarian, it's not vegan. Do you want ketchup? Yes, please. I'm gonna need a little more ketchup. ketchup. I'm not gonna say it tastes like trash. Uh, I think the spicy really helped the spicy black bean. Mm hmm. Very chewy. Still chewing. Did I turn off the oven? Oh my god, I didn't. Ah! <laughs> Irresponsible. What do you rate this? Six, because it's not as good as the spicy black bean. Yeah, I would give the oh, I would give this a seven out of ten. The spicy black bean was definitely better if you want like flavor. We have the Morning Star Veggie Classics corn dog. It looks like this. Honestly, oh. I've never liked corn dogs. Like even when I did eat meat, like this was just not my thing. But we're gonna try it out. Wait, do you like your corn dogs with uh, mustard? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> That was actually really funny because I literally look like Princess Leia right now. Oh! John and I are trying to be be like really healthy. <laughs> well, other than today and like yesterday and tomorrow probably. <laughs> mm. That's a hot dog. That's oh my god! Not a hot dog. Whoa! Damn, this tastes like a freaking hot dog. Does it not? Wait, you just had one yesterday. Wow. This is the best corn dog I have ever had in my entire life. Yeah. If you're craving a corn dog and you don't eat meat and like, or you just don't want to eat meat, morning star, dude. If you want to like have family over and they are like, oh, oh I missed. if you're having family over and you know they're like 
against vegetarianism, then feed them this. And give that a 10. Yeah, I give this freaking corn dog a 10 out of 10. Wait, that means the burrito is better than this. I give this corn dog a 10.6 out of 10. <laughs> this one's a different brand. It's got the Guardian uh, Crispy Tender 7 Grain. Okay, so this is what the chicken tenders look like. They look pretty chicken tendery. Looks like a chicken to me. Let's do this. Does it taste like anything? I don't think so. These don't have any flavor. These chicken tenders are vegan, by the way. They're like good. They're decent like if you're just craving like a snack. If you're craving like a, like the fried part. Yeah, like, the fried, fried. like a crispy. If you're craving like real food that tastes good, I wouldn't buy these. You can rate it first. A six. I'm gonna rate these chicken tenders um, five out of ten. Honestly, I just want to say your top looks really cute. Thanks. Like really cute. Now we're gonna get to like the snacks slash desserts. Snacks. These are the Enjoy Life chocolate chunky crunchy crunchy cookies, and these are vegan, so they're free from all the allergens allergens allergens. Those are all the ones. Ooh. Ooh, wait, these actually look kind of good. Ooh, I'm, I'm excited. excited. So this is what the cookie looks like. Looks like a regular cookie. They're just really hard. If we could like make these softer, they would be 10 out of 10. But they're like gluten-free, vegan, they're everything. Mustard-free. What do you think? Pretty good. Maybe like a seven. I would say like, an 8.5. Let's move on. So now we have the pure organic chocolate brownie. It's seven simple ingredients, so that's pretty cool. But I could probably just make this. No, literally, like I really could. Really? So let's try this. It looks like a fudge brownie, and it has like walnuts and the chocolate chips, so it looks good to me. That's gross. <laughs> mm, tastes like a protein bar. It has four grams of protein, but it tastes like it has 35. Pure organic was not good. That was gross. Um, I would do not recommend pure organic. Brownie, do you? I'm gonna rate this brownie a one out of 10 because it's the grossest thing I've eaten today. I'll give the brownie like a three. Okay. Okay guys, so last but not least, we got two different types of ice cream. So the first one, is the so delicious dairy free and it's the cashew milk salted caramel cluster it looks like this well, bam. okay oh so the inside looks like this pretty clustery oh wait look at that it like just went in like easily pretty creamy <laughs> <laughs> i don't get it very flavorful yeah you get like a burst of flavor immediately oh man it it's really like Perfectly soft too. Mm -hmm. Like I'm, pancakes, it tastes like pancakes. I'm usually not into this kind of stuff, like this flavor. Me either. I'm happy. Which is weird, cause like the one we're about to try, what's next is usually like our favorite. Our real fans already know what's coming up next. <laughs> <laughs> Were you trying to be like Southern? I don't know, we don't know what that was. It sounded like a Southern Obama. Wait, do your Obama impression. I will rate this ice cream a 10 out of 10. Wait, that was Southern. <laughs> that was really good. So, so delicious, dairy free, 10 out of 10. What do you say? 10. So the next one we have is one that we've already tried, so I don't know if that's cheating, but we figured we'd try it again because it's been a long time. It's the Ben & Jerry's peanut butter and cookies ice cream. Well, bam. This is what it looks like, the inside. Oh wait, this one's creamy too, remember? It's been a while. It's been a long day. It's not as flavorful as the other one. I mean, I still like it, like it's really good and you can taste it. If you like peanut butter, get it because that's like the main flavor. I don't love it. Yeah, Ben and Jerry, they didn't do that good of a job with this one. We should probably call them up. Should we call Ben or Jerry? Jerry, because Tom and Jerry, remember? Jerry was the mouse. And he was really nice. Oh. Ooh. We found like this giant like chunk of peanut butter. That's all, all peanut, peanut butter. Peanut butter. Mmm. I'll let you have it. No, I don't want it. Oh, I thought you said, mmm, that's good. No, I'm saying, mmm. <laughs> the Ben and Jerry's gets an, like a seven out of 10. Okay, so now we're gonna tell you guys our top winners. 
from everything that we tried today. How about we say at the same time? Okay, let's do favorite meal first, okay? I'll Three, say- Three, two, one. Corn, corn dogs. dogs. <laughs> favorite dessert. Three, two, one. Salt so and delicious. Care. Yeah. Okay, we both agree then, that's good. First time we agreed all day. <laughs> Ain't that something. <laughs> <laughs> that is all we have for you guys today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. And also like this video because I'm over you guys watching and not liking it. Like, it's just annoying. See you next time. Three, two, one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>